on with the omnibus bill. Yeah, another concern, carjackings. Our Liana Golden is on your side with important tips on how to prevent becoming a victim. Well, it is scary to think about grabbing your keys, buckling up for wherever you may be going, and then suddenly someone else is in control of your car. So how do you reduce the risk of becoming a victim of carjacking? We're on your side with some tips from DC police. So let's start with where MPD says carjackings can happen any place, but some spots are more common like ATMs, self-serve gas stations, parking garages, and just your sidewalk. So before you get out of your car at any of these places, MPD says make sure it is a well lit area and to even skip the spot next to the dumpster or any large trucks if you can avoid it. Carjacking can actually happen on the road too. MPD recommends driving in the center lane to make it harder for carjackers to approach your car and always drive with your windows and doors locked. If a thief can't get in your car, well, you have a better chance of leaving with it. And when you're coming to a stop, leave enough room to maneuver around other cars, especially if you sense trouble and need to get away. As always, as you're approaching your car, be alert. Have your keys in your hand ready to go before you get in and look around and even under your car and inside before you hit the road. If you do become a victim of carjacking, immediately pick up your phone and dial 911 to report the crime to police. I'm Liana Golden, 7 News. Some really good tips there. All right, well, carjackings in D.C. seem to have